Hi, my little raindrops. Uh, welcome to my childhood bedroom. So I am finally back home for the summer. There, I have, I have so many things to tell you. Honestly, there, I should film just one YouTube video to tell you everything that's been going on. But long story short, I was supposed to come back a week ago, but then some stuff happened that required me to stay to my university apartment. But now I am here and I have so much stuff to unpack. It is unreal. Uh, my priorities for now though are to change my bedding. That's gonna be a pain because I hate with a passion to put the corner sheets. Usually my boyfriend does that, but he's not here. So gonna have to figure that out on my own. So that is like the very first thing that I really want to do. And then I want to clean up my desk because I am now a tutor and I have my first session tomorrow. And um, I want to have like a nice clean area. I want to be able to have a kind of office space. But this is where the magic happens for the business. This is where everything started. It's actually on this very bed right here right there, that I opened up my very first pack of business cards. So this room has a lot of good memories. Um, so what we're gonna be doing today, I might actually uh, combine a couple of clips. I'll probably like record myself throughout the next couple of days redoing my room a little bit because like I said, I want to change my bedding, I want to clean up my desk, <laughs> and I need to figure out what to do with all of the books that I brought from my apartment. And I am pretty tired still. Uh, it was a very big day yesterday, it was moving day. So I'm trying to take things one thing at a time, but if I can just get my bed done today and kind of set up my desk and take out the things that I need the most right now, which are uh, my bookmarks, I need to make some. So if I can just get all of that settled, I should be good. It, it will have to work. So we're gonna start off with the bed. Yay! Before, can we appreciate this blanket? My best friend made it for me. She had some help from her mom, but just look at it. Handmade. Handmade. And it's it's the it's the perfect big cozy 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 blanket. Okay. We're gonna get started. Um yeah, we're we're just gonna go for it. Start off by taking everything off. This looks so good. Now, I guess that I'm gonna 
do a little bit of tidying up for my desk. Yeah, I think so. Okay, this is where I really like started my business. Um, still can't believe, whoa. My desk is now downstairs. Um, I'm probably, I don't know, I might keep that small one. And, oh, okay, I think I have an idea. But uh, I have space for another type of bookshelf now, so that's good. But now I'm gonna go set up my desk downstairs. And yeah, that's, that's pretty much that. But I do wanna make sure that I'm all settled in by the end of the week because I have a lot of stuff to do and I wanna make sure that I do it. So we're gonna go downstairs and we're gonna set up the desk. Here's the new setup. Still need to clean that. We have a bunch of flower petals, but this is what we've got for now. And this is where I will be working this summer on the business and other projects. I need to go through all of these. These are old and this is, I don't know, there was a plant there. I'm gonna to need to clean that up, but I have a bunch of books that will need to be wrapped. And now it's time to set up the desk. So now I just have my bags of clothes that I'm going to need to somehow put away. I brought this separate bookshelf to connect it with this one. I need to empty this out because I want to put more books in there. And what I think I'm going to do now, I'm going to get started on just going through some of my books and see which ones I want to keep, which ones I want to get rid of. Well, get rid of. I'm gonna put them up on my uh, on my website. So we're gonna, we're gonna do it one step at a time because I am a bit tired, so I don't want to push myself too much. Like I keep saying, but I keep kind of ignoring it. <laughs> but uh, we're we're gonna get into it. Okay, I have the box, and I'm gonna get started. I'm gonna start at the top. And we're gonna see how things go. I have like some decorative things that I got from like book boxes. I got, yes, these are fake eggs. Um, I don't know. So, so these two are, I'll leave in the books that I know that I'll keep. right in here. Okay, so we're gonna speed this up so that you don't have to just like watch me look at books for hours on end. <laughs>
entire Shadow and Bone series and I haven't read it. Oops. All of this, this entire box, all of these are going to be blind dates with a book. So that's, oh, I also have some over here. Um, this book was horrifying, like horrifying in a sense that it was not good at all, unfortunately. I'm, I'm sorry. I also had a collector's edition of Insurgent. I got it when I hadn't even read Divergent. Also got these. Okay, so I've done I've done a lot for today. I think I'm gonna stop cleaning for the rest of the day because I need to prep for my tutoring session for tomorrow. So I think that's what I'm gonna do for the rest of the afternoon. Um, I don't know what time it is, but it's currently three o'clock, which is kind of like the time of the day where I am most kind of, ugh, you know, but I think that's just a human thing. So I'm just gonna go downstairs, maybe go read outside for a little bit and also work on that tutoring session so that I'm ready for tomorrow. I'm probably gonna go downstairs and make some bookmarks so that I can pack some orders. Um, but yeah, that is, that is it for today's part. Okay, um, I know that I said that I was gonna stop for today and that I was gonna keep going tomorrow, but it is still Tuesday. I just look a bit different because I took off my makeup because it's like eight o'clock. But I've decided that I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna put a little bit more like order in like, here, should I try to put some kind of order? Because I don't want to color code them and I don't want to do it like by alphabetical order. Um, okay, we can, we can start. So today is day number two of cleaning up my bedroom and trying to fit all of the boxes of books that I had into my bookshelves that I already have so that I don't have to buy more because I'm trying to save my money. But so far, uh, I did a little bit of cleanup last night that I didn't record just because I ran out of space and I got lazy. But so this is what I've got so far going on for this one. I still need to like remove the knickknacks. Basically, all of these will be filled out with books. And then this, that's the situation here. I am dividing my books in genres. So this, 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 and this right there are all fantasy. And I did not think that I had so much fantasy. Honestly, I thought I had more romance, but I still have all of these books to go through and these two bins but i think that it might actually fit because i also have this one i'm gonna remove like the frames and everything and i'm gonna fill this one up if i don't have any more space and then the other one on the other side of the this is my manga shelf which i pretty much already put all the manga that i did buy throughout the school year it's already in there so what we're gonna be focusing on right now is to just like kind of divide in these bins because I know the other two over there are all romance books I took out all the fantasy from there so in here I'm basically just gonna split up what is fantasy what isn't so that I can shelve 
all my fantasy books right away. Uh, right now it's 12 o'clock. Usually this is when I have lunch, but I'm not all that hungry right now. So I'm gonna go have lunch once this is kind of cleared up. Let's divide some books now. <laughs> romance and other genres that are not fantasy so we're gonna start shelving so that i can at least get all of my fantasy shelves done because that's like my priority right now a very big Jennifer Armentrout phase. for mostly like non-fiction and poetry so I'm gonna put all of Rupi Kaur's collection over there. Now what I need to do is take care of this which is basically like mostly romance or um, those kinds of books. So I don't exactly know where to start. But we will go with the flow. It's a little bit overwhelming because I have no idea what to do. Like I said, we're just going to go with the flow. I'm so sorry, my phone, every single day, like on day one, it ran out of space. And then on day two, it ran out of space. So I'm gonna try to do this quick so it does not, again, run out of space. It's completed. So let's do like a really, really quick little room tour. Um, if you want a bookshelf tour, please let me know and I will make one because these are my precious. Okay, let's do the little room tour. I forgot to record the desk view, so I'm just gonna like interrupt 
the bedroom to her and just like squeeze this in. This is the desk setup. It's, ignore the bag. Usually I have it there, but Bowie has been going inside and trying to make a mess out of it. So this is the desk area. This is where I'm going to be, you know, packing orders, creating new products, wrapping books, doing all that fun stuff. I have all my annotating kit things here. I have packing supplies, more packing supplies iPad, uh, computer, beautiful view. I mean, wow, I actually have space too. I have all of this, all these books. Yes, I'm restocking soon, don't worry. And then boxes. And also this thing that I brought from my apartment. So that is the desk setup right here. It is lovely, okay. Now we can go back to the bedroom tour. So, when you come inside, I don't know, I made my bed, but it still doesn't look all that made up. But it's really nice, it's really cozy, I love my blanket, I love this, I love everything, it's so comfortable. And then the bookshelf here is not super clean or really aesthetic, but it's a vibe. That's me and my mom having lunch in the Eiffel Tower. <laughs> that is my name written in Japanese from the Japan Expo. That is Jimin from BTS, hand-drawn by someone at Japan Expo. That's Bowie crying in the background. These are all my non-fiction books. This is a journal, but I have, like, poetry. Uh, I have, you know, just regular non-fiction, self-help, um, travel books, because I want to go to London and Paris. And that is pretty much that bookshelf. If we make our way over here, this is my manga bookshelf. I have a picture of me and my parents uh, from when I graduated. So this is it's kind of annoying that it's going that way, but it's fine. And then I have more manga in the back. Uh, my dad is going to build me those little shelves to put at the back to like elevate them. And then <laughs> I kind of forgot that was there. And then more manga. I have two Studio Ghibli movies. Um, I don't have a CD player, but I really, really love these. So I have two of them. And then more fruit. We have Fruits Basket and Heart Stopper Fell. Oh my god. I cannot buy Volume 2 in stores. I need to order it from Amazon. And I'm the worst buying books online. I just feel guilty every single time, so I'm gonna wait. Hopefully, it'll be in store when I go back to my apartment. And then my K-pop albums, and then my Switch in the background there. And then, uh, because I do have a walk-in closet, but it is such a mess in there, and I don't want to go inside. So I just put my clothes in some PC bins. Because, yeah, we have my fan. That's lovely. Ignore the ring light. But now, just... Okay, let's zoom out a little. Look at that. Look at how pretty that is. That needs to go away. I still want to clean those out. But all the books fit. But I still have a feeling that I have more. And I just don't know where they are. So maybe I will end up finding a box of books and <laughs> filling out those. Um, but yeah, let's just do like a mini mini tour. So these six, these two, these two, these two, and then this one are all fantasy. And then these are all like, they're mostly romance, although I do have like some mystery type of books and some like random genres. So I have, sorry for the wire there. I do have some nonfiction books over there. Um, just to have, I don't know, I kind of like it there. And, um, yeah, that's that. I need to put that away. That's another book, but it's like, you have to solve the crime. So that's why I'm not putting it aside, just because I need all of that in one. And then I have my classics over here. And all Christina Lauren. And then all Colleen Hoover. I need to put that that way. These are all Colleen Hoover. And then these are all books that stops here these these i haven't read this one i have uh but most of the books in these shelves are books that i have read before or that i've annotated mostly 
And on top here, I have my little, like, Harry Potter shrine, I guess. <laughs> my boyfriend had bought me um, these little houses to build. And then, of course, these little Christmas ornaments. And then candles. And this is an award that I got from um, my, uh, the, the deputy that, the deputy from uh, Madawaska Restigouche, Renal Seno. He gave me this award for my business last summer, and I am super proud of it. And um, I have a painting friends made for me last year, and it is just right there so I can think of them. And then I have a Natsu and Lucy LED lamp type thing because I love them so much. I can't remember the name of the place that I got it, but I did find them on TikTok. Google Home TV that um then these are just kind of they're mostly books that i will be wrapping up to sell as blind dates like all of these are books that i'll be wrapping up and they are from my bookshelf so i'll be doing something like go on a blind date with a book from desiree's bookshelf or desiree's library or something like that and they'll have like i don't know maybe like a special sticker on the wrapping to say that it was from my library and then these are all books that I accidentally bought that were, like, part of a series. And, like, this is book... I think it's book two, and this is book four. So I can't really sell them. So I think that I'm just gonna go bring them to my secondhand bookstore, get some credit for them, and I'll just get more books for the business. This is a picture wall that needs a little bit more attention. This is where my desk used to be, and this is where I used to study and work. So... Yeah, I, um, I'm not entirely sure what I want to do with this area. I wanted to do, like, a reading nook, but I'm trying to save up my money. So I might be able to buy some kind of little chair or something, but I do kind of like reading in my bed. But anywho, that is the situation right here. It's not really, like, it's not in my way or anything. It's just kind of there, you know? Wow, when I zoom out, it was, it's really blurry. Okay. Anywho, this is it. This, this is it. This is my room. It's, it's really nice. My mom got me a welcome home plant. And, um, yeah. <laughs> that is it. Yep, that, yep, that, that's it. So that is it for my clean, my bedroom, organize my bookshelves type of video. I don't even know what I'm going to call this video, honestly. It's probably just going to be, like, Reorganize my bedroom with me, aka. Or maybe I should do like fitting 10 boxes of books in two bookshelves. Well, that's a lie. I have three. So we're gonna do that. I think that's what I'm gonna call it. I don't know. We're gonna figure out a title later. But that is it for the video. I hope you enjoyed it. I am so sorry that I couldn't film more of me like shelving my bookshelves. Um, I need a actual like better camera uh with more space but i do hope you enjoyed it now i'm gonna go edit this video so that i can schedule it to post on monday and i'm gonna come back upstairs and record my june wrap up because today i think we're july 9th i'm getting a little bit behind here i don't know what whatever I'm getting a little bit behind, so we're going to try to edit this video, get it ready to go, and then I'm going to record my June wrap-up, because I read 15 books in June. Most of them are in this shelf. Um, but yes, that was it. That was all. Thank you for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one. Mm -hmm.